Thursday, February 22nd, 2007. This is Steve Thompson for InfoLive TV. Hamas and Islamic Jihad angered after the death of Jihad leader in the West Bank. Hamas's Qassam Brigades has declared an end to the ceasefire with Israel as a result of the killing of the Islamic Jihad leader Mahmoud Qasim by Israeli forces. Abu Abaida, a spokesman for the Qassam Brigades, said, The truce with Israeli occupation is no longer valid. Olmert, I'm ready to talk with enemies. In addition, the British Prime Minister asserted that Israel should negotiate and talk with moderates of Hamas. However, Olmert has also stated that Hamas is not ready to talk to Israel or recognize it. Afghanistan's new weapon, suicide bombers. The Taliban has presented its new weapon in Afghanistan, a battalion of terrorist suicide bombers ready to attack Western forces in the southern part of Afghanistan. Italian Prime Minister Romano Prodi quit after the Senate of his country refused to increase the number of troops in Afghanistan. President Napolitano is making consultations with various parties in order to form a new government. Maccabi Tel Aviv goes to Lotomatica, Roma tonight. Maccabi is hopeful, leading up to the Roma clash of winning. And Hapoel Tel Aviv meets CSK Moskwa in Tel Aviv tonight. Join us today on InfoLive TV as we cover billionaire Arkady Gaidamak's bid to enter Israeli politics. We continue with coverage of Iranian refusal to abide by UN resolutions on its nuclear program. Join us today as we cover the tearful reunion of lone combat soldiers with their parents. InfoLive.tv, the world's first television channel broadcasting on the web in four languages, live from Jerusalem. If you want a direct look at Israel and the Middle East, InfoLive TV is there, at the heart of the information, at the heart of history, at the heart of Israel. InfoLive.tv